What's going on guys, it's coming at you guys with a video pretty much showing you my top tweaks for the iPhone 4S. These tweaks are going to be mainly focused on the Siri aspect of the iPhone 4S. So, let's not waste any more of your time, and let's get into this video. Alrighty guys, so the first tweak we're going to have, for specifically made for the iPhone 4S, obviously is going to be Siri. So the first one's called Siri Mic Colors. So essentially, once you open up Siri, Siri, how are you doing today? As you can see right there, the color is just different uh, colors than the actual purple color that Siri originally comes for. The next tweak is called hands-free control, which pretty much allows you to use the Siri feature without even, you know, holding down the home button. So I'll give you guys a little test. Siri, how is the weather today? Pretty much this tweak is called hands-free control, which is very useful, so you don't even really have to press this button. There's different ways you can activate this. You just go under the settings tab, go under hands-free control, and you can actually uh, have a keyword, so you can put Siri, computer, Jarvis, which is, which is sort of interesting. Um, you can pretty much tweak it, so you can have different... Uh, audio qualities and also the sensitivity. I, I put mine on very strict. Um, it seems to work out pretty decent. The next tweak is called Siri toggles. So essentially you can use this hand in hand with hands free control. So Siri, turn on Bluetooth. Enabling Bluetooth. So as you guys can see right here, you can pretty much toggle on and off the main switches. For example, Siri, turn off Wi-Fi. Disabling Wi-Fi. So that's that's pretty neat to me. This tweak is called Siri toggles. The next tweak is pretty interesting. Uh, it has to deal with the notification bar, so you can be able to use this with any iOS 5 device that uses the notification center so say if I have anything open or just the home screen it actually just pulls everything down like so so if you pull down the notification bar it pulls the entire screen down instead of just the notification bar which is um, in my opinion is a very solid tweak so if you have any application open it essentially just pulls it down you would be able to do it that way that is called flotation and the last and final tweak is called SB settings. This is sort of, this is a sort of an older application, but it's definitely modified for the iOS 5 uh, software and the iPhone 4S, which is very cool. It's going to be located in the notification center, so you just pull this down, and then you'll see toggles that I've set for myself. Uh, airplane mode brightness, which you can modify the brightness at any point. Uh, the Bluetooth on and off Wi-Fi and my 3G unrestricted app, which allows me to, you know, do FaceTime over a 3G. As you can see right here, you have more refresh, uh, the drop down pin, which is like the original SB settings, and then the respring. All of these are very, uh, this is pretty much one of the more handy things that I've had in the notification bar, so I can respring whenever I want, turn off toggles uh, very fast, and you actually have, uh, if you hit more, you'll be able to go into the actual SB settings part of things and then modify the thing from here turn the toggles on and off uh, add different themes and whatnot you can do tons of customizations with SB settings and it it works really well with uh, with the notification center so that's gonna wrap this video guys if you guys have any other tweaks made specifically for the iPhone 4s that I missed out on that are pretty cool be sure to leave a comment down below in the box be sure to give this video a thumbs up feel free to subscribe and this has been Christian, also known as King Atlas. You guys take it easy. Peace.